What is up, you guys? Thank you for coming in here, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to stream super easy to YouTube gaming or anything else, really. But this is just basic settings you're going to want for OBS Studios, you guys. Really quick video. Don't expect anything big. If you want something even bigger, if you want a more in-depth tutorial, please comment down below and I will do so. But otherwise, I'm just going to give you guys the base of what you're going to need to know for OBS Studios. So, guys, first, general settings are pretty simple. It's ignore everything on here except for the language just keep it on whatever language you're in on stream stream type make sure you have it on streaming services on service make sure you have it on whatever service you're actually using so if you're using youtube have it on youtube if you're using twitch have it on twitch and stream key i'm going to show you how to get a stream key right now you guys if you're going to use youtube go to the youtube live streaming dashboard scroll down and you should see streaming key do not show this to anyone this is how people can hack your account or your stream you don't want that to happen that'd be terrible and uh, yeah so you pretty much take this and you go and move it you copy paste it to your section on OBS where it says stream key and then the two kind of link together so it's, it's really easy it's super simple okay guys next setting is output for output make sure you have output mode on simple Video bitrate should be around 2,500 to 300 depending on your internet. Encoder should be on software x264. Audio bitrate should be on 160. And recording path just is where you want to have your recording software uh, send your video to. It's really, you don't have to worry about that, but this is for streaming. So, um, yeah, make sure video bitrate doesn't go above 3,500. Definitely, you don't need anything more than that. Moving on to audio, pretty much if you guys have a mono mic, make sure it's on. Cha make sure channels is on mono. If you have a stereo mic, make sure it's on stereo. Have sample bit rates of 44 hertz. That's just my setting. These are pretty much all things you have to go through, guys, depending on your setup. So make sure you check out your hardware uh, and devices you're using. Make sure they're all good. Video should be on 1920 1080p if you have that type of monitor. And some people like to downscale. I like downscaling to 720p because most people watch streams at 720p. And I stream at 60fps. So make sure that your thing's on 30fps, 60fps, or if you're into it, 48fps, whatever you guys are comfy with. You kind of have to feel out the settings, but they're all safe settings. If you want to set up hotkeys, you can set up hotkeys. I don't use hotkeys, but if you want to set them up, go ahead and use your keys to set them up. Advanced, uh, leave everything alone in advance. You really shouldn't have to touch anything like that. Um, otherwise, guys, that's really it for streaming. It's really not that hard to set up your OBS for streaming to YouTube or Twitch or whatever. If you guys have any questions down below, please comment, okay? Please leave a question for me if you do have a question. And if you just want to comment that it was a good video, I'd also appreciate that as well. Leave a like on it if you did enjoy it. Leave a dislike if you didn't like it and tell me why you didn't like it so I can maybe fix it. Um, and subscribe if you're new. So yeah, guys, that's all I got for you. It's been Vicky428. It doesn't cost anything to be kind. And uh, have a good day. Bye, guys.